You better hand them over to us, twerp. You better hand them over to us, twerp. <laughs> What's going on guys? It is the Phantom Mago and I'm bringing you episode number 5 of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee, Go Lock Challenge. And of course, I am joined with my boy, DJ Spinda. What's going on guys? DJ Spinda here. Alright you guys, on the last episode, we came through this route, we caught ourselves a new Mon, we also had a Go Challenge, so go check that out. So yeah, let's do a quick team recap, and I'm sure you guys can figure out what happened. So, up first, I have the winner of the Go Challenge. <laughs> I have Sparrow, named Hawkins. I also have Venus, my Bellsprout. I have Monarch, my Metapod. I have Yellow Jacket, my Kakuna. And I, of course, I have my starter, McCloud, the Eevee. And the newest member of my team, Wormtail the Rattata. Hmm. Nice. All right. Uh, let's see. First up, I have my starter, Cheeks the Pikachu at level 12. And then we got William the Metapod at level 9. And then we've got, we've got uh, Benny the uh, Kakuna, level 8. And we got Laranda the Rattata at level 9, and our newest member, Captain the Spiro at level 6. So, right I've got a team of 5 now. <laughs> hmm. Alright, I'm gonna battle some trainers, and we're gonna get right over to Mount Moon. Oh, yeah, there is, this guy is selling Magikarps. There's a guy here buy, selling Magikarps. For real? Yeah. Yeah, I'm buying one. Yeah. Definitely buying one. Now I have a team of 6. <laughs> Nice. Well, you're about to get another team, too, from uh, the... Uh... Yeah, I might actually make some party switches. Now you can't be whited out, either. Exactly. Uh, let's see. Level 10 Hawks. Hawkins. Got a level 5 Magikarp. Nice. Boom. So, do you think we are prepared to handle another one of those tra crazy trainers? I think I, if it's a Squirtle, you would. You'll do fine. Yeah. But if it's a Charmander, I'm going to be royally screwed. <laughs> oh, no, I clicked on him. No, no, oh, I don't want to do it. Not yet. He can say no. It says, do you want to train a bit before taking on Mount Moon? Not now. Okay. <laughs> no thanks. Whew. I might go see if I can scoop up a Geodude, because I have a feeling if it's a Charmander, I'm going to be in some trouble. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, Charmander wouldn't be the ideal option for me either. Oh, my gosh. There's Mankey in this grass over here. Oh. You can catch it. Add it to your decks. That would have been so perfect for an encounter. Man. Catch it, add it to your decks. I know, I'm just really sad. I, I really wanted a Mankey. I caught an Ekans in between episodes. You little punk. He's just slapping Pokeballs away. I wonder if I have Ekans and you have Mankey. Yeah, because I haven't seen an Ekans yet. I've seen a whole bunch of Ekans. This is the first Mankey I've seen, though. I'm gonna throw you would think Jigglypuff would also appear. Yeah, we might see you some in Mount Moon, though. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. Oh, that's Clefairy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You said Jigglypuff. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go into Mount Moon. Okay, I just I'm catching this man here. Or do you want me? To... Oh, dude, there's a Meowth sleeping on top of the tunnel. Oh, sweet, dude! I caught the Mankey. I only got 29 experience for that. What trash? How does it? Okay, I'm talking. I'm talking to the sleeping Meowth. It says, it's a sleeping Pokemon. It doesn't seem like a Pokeball will do very much while it's in this state. That doesn't make any sense. True. That is really weird. Hmm. Um. So I was wondering, since we can't like switch to different boxes and stuff, I've got my dead Oddish just chilling there. Do I? Just... <laughs> do you want to release it? Do you want to? That's what I'm wondering. Like, what do we do there? Turn it to candies, man. It was level. Turn it to candies or leave it. 
I think I'm gonna leave it in case I need cut. I don't think I have anything that could learn cut. HM HM corpse. Oh, you know what? If HMs aren't a thing though, then I can get rid of it. Cause we saw that chop thing or whatever, whatever it's called. You know. That's true. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna go into Mount Moon then and get an encounter with ya. Oh, I have. I didn't go in yet. I was. I was count talking to all the trainers inside the Pokemon Center. Okay. A sleeping Pokemon. It doesn't seem like a Pokeball will do very much while it's in this state. I feel like it would do exactly what it's supposed to do while it's in that state. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Got a magic card. You know what I'm nicknaming? The oh, it's a female. You know oh I'm yeah, I forgot the nickname mine. Yikes. It's Hyd. It's Hydra. <laughs> Mine's a female one. It's not a shiny, so I can't name it Russia. True. Um. A female Magikarp. Did, oh, dude, that's right. I caught a Gyarados our very first playthrough of um, our Soul Link of uh, Leaf Green and Fire Red. Hydra. Oh, yeah. linked, linked with Teddy Ursa. <laughs> yeah. That was Wendy. That was Wendy. Oh, that's dip. All right. I'm about to roll inside Mount Moon. I'll, we'll do it together. Okay. Um... Let's, Guppy. Let's name let's name her Ta Tiffany. Tiana. I don't know why, but it just sounds like a cool name for a Gyarados. Boom. Okay. Let's go. You ready? Ooh. Oh, you know what? One more thing I'm gonna do. <laughs> Here we go, baby. Follow me, magic card. <laughs> You're sick. You're sick. I'm twisted. All right. All right, I'm closing my eyes. I'm going in. Let's do this. Go, 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 go. I have to. Oh gosh, at... I ran oh, into my... something instantly. Gee, All dude. Right. All right, let's do it. What is it? Come on, something running into me. Oh, there's a cutscene. I just walked into. As it. the ring gets smaller, your chances. Why did it show me that catching thing again? Dylan. What's up? I just ran into a cutscene. Oh, I thought you encountered a Pokemon. No, I ran right into a cutscene. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna catch this Geodude. That'll be my encounter. One, two, three! Hey! Dude, a golem would be really clutch. It would be pretty dope. And I can see it roll around on the ground. With explosion. Alright, we got ourselves a Geodude. So who wants to be... Oh, I don't want to spoil who I ran into. Okay, hold on. Uh, Mount... Moon. Okay. Alright. A cops, a G, a dude. Oh. Oh, it's Jesse and James! Am I voicing both of them again, or are we just... What are we doing? I'll be Jesse. Oh, okay. Looks like there's nothing here. Then let's just search further in. Uh, is that, you, that must be her. You were, you were eavesdropping on, on us just now, weren't you? Uh, meow. Their hands move. <laughs> meow. You were supposed to be keeping watch. Oh, that was their meow. Oh my gosh. We know there's rare fossils buried around here somewhere. If you've got any, you better hand them over. You. To us, twerp. You better hand him over to us, twerp. <laughs> That's right. If anyone is going to profit off those fossils, it's gonna be us. <laughs> Meowth. That's right. All right. Back to close my eyes. Let's get this. Let's get this encounter. We got some zoo bats up in here. Dude, a crow. Oh, there would be no crow bat. No crow bat, sir. Come on, man. Okay, I'm gonna... I have not ran into anything. Dang. Dude, I have no idea where I'm at right now. <laughs> okay. Let's go left. You might be running into a Zubat, my friend. Oh. Oh, it's a trainer battle. Bling, 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 bling. 
All right, let's take a look at my party situation. I think I'm gonna get rid of one of my bugs, Mike. That's probably a good call. Well, who are you gonna get rid of though? Butterfree, or? I think Butterfree's learn set's Beedrill. probably better than Beedrill's. I don't know, Twin Needle on a Beedrill would be pretty clutch. At the same time, a lot of stuff is different in this game. That's true. So. Come on. Yeah. Just killed a Butterfree. Dang. I'm throwing that Geodude on my on my party here. Mick Cloud grew to 13. Uh, let's see. What am I going to name Geodude? Giovanni. Is it a male one? Yep. I can't remember. Hey, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to close my eyes. There's a Pokemon right beside me, but I, I still have to encounter it. So hopefully it runs into me. My eyes are closed. Okay, that's a Pokemon. It's a Geodude. I ran into a Geodude. <laughs> Okay. Now we both have a Geo, dude. Okay. Uh, let's see. Magikarp, I got a name there. T -t -t uh, Geo, dude. What am I naming Geo, dude? Oh. Geo, dude. Geo, dude. Uh, let's see. Change name. Come on, Geo. I'm gonna name it Xavier. I don't know. Charles. What... <laughs> Xavier the Geo dude. Alrighty. My team is still booty booty butt cheeks. All right, I caught it with a great ball. Yours was a G dude too, you said? Yep. Uh-oh. DJ Spinda. What's up? It's your favorite part of any kind of recording. What's that? Uh, overlay change. Oh, you got an evolution happening, my friend? Dude, G dude looks freakishly realistic on this overworld. Whoa. It's weird. Who's evolving for you? Kakuna. Kakuna. Now you got yourself yeah, a bee yeah. drill. Oh, watch me destroy this butterfree. Twin needle. Yes, sir. Ooh, he lived one hit. That's crazy. Do I want to add the Geodude to my team? Do you want to add a Geodude to your team? I'm gonna catch the. Alright, so now we can just catch whatever Pokemon we want here, but they have to be. Absolutely. Oh, I'm wasting. Oh my goodness. Xavier learned bide. What's going on? You throwing all over the place there, Mike? Yeah, I wasted like four great balls. <laughs> I'm trying to catch a Dude, Paris. I just got five great balls. That's pretty sweet. I'm trying to catch this Paris. I honestly wouldn't have minded a Zubat as an encounter. It wouldn't have been horrible. That would have been clutch. Just think, though, if this had, like, all generations of Pokemon in it, how much more exciting this would be. It would be wild. <laughs> Alright, so I can't keep Paris, though. Just like I, I, I got rid of that Bulbasaur. So, you true, guys know I'm true. playing fair. <laughs> Alright, so the Paris is not mine. Send him Paris right to the professor level 10. Thunder Shock. Oh dang, quick detected more. I got the paralysis on him. Hee <laughs> hee! We got Hydro, what are we gonna name this Geodude? Mmm. I wonder when we unlock more clothing and stuff for our Pokemans. 
Geodude's name is Beth. Beth? Beth. Beth. Okay, I don't want... I don't like attributing to my fighting type weakness. But I don't like attributing to my three... I have three Pokemon weak to rock. I have two Pokemon weak to fighting. Three Pokemon weak to fire. Jeez. Oh, oh, I ran into... Oh, hey, oh, my. Another cutscene, Mike. Oh, my bad. I'm trying to... I'll keep my team as it is right now. Hold up, I'm coming. Is this still Bullet Seed? Nope. It you, How far to the left did you go? Just past the main area here, past the sign. You went past the sign? I think. Oh, no, I battled that trainer up there. Yeah. I see James up there. Yeah, I'm by the ladder. Okay. Hmm. Go, go ahead, you talk for her. You talk for her. Go ahead. Ugh, oh, you're pretty fast, kid. Oh, that's it. She ran away. Okay. <laughs> I like that you can just run around the cave and not get stopped randomly, though. There's a ton of trainers in here. Holy crap. And you were the one who said, we need trainers. Yeah, we do. I mean... Yeah. Oh, that, that Geodude spawned on me. That's insane. Uh-oh. You ready for another layout change? Oh, another evolution? Yep. Dang. Dude, the face of the super nerd is creepy. Are you seeing this? Ooh. So creepy yeah. looking. Ugh. So now you've got a bee drill and a butterfree, huh? Mm-hmm. This dude's got himself a Grimer. Who'd you keep? You kept, uh... I kept the... I'm gonna go with butterfree for now so i'm gonna i'm gonna get rid of i'm gonna get rid of butterfree yeah because i was like i kind of would like to have a psychic type move for instances like this against this grimer you know what i mean mm -hmm. i'm gonna get rid of butterfree and i'm gonna add beth I think I'm gonna swap here. Okay. Let's go out into Xavier here. Go ahead and add this Zubat to my, my part of my. Uh... Go ahead and hit, use Pound on Xavier, see what happens. <laughs> Nothing. Someone will laugh in your face. Tackle. Ugh. Landed a crit pound. That's no fun. Did you go down the ladder or no? No, I haven't. I've got two Pokemon that are poisoned now, thanks to this one Grimer. Did you buy antidotes? I do have a few antidotes, yeah. That's good. Xavier's level seven. Oh, a Clefairy, bro. Oh, that would have been a nice encounter. All right. Well, now I got to do some party work here. Medicine antidote. I have five of them. Is all. Because we can catch Pokemon, because that's like, um, battles. Yep, it's like, yeah, we treat it as if we were battling wild Pokemon. All right. Have you been catching Pokemon, too, that you don't have? Uh, not really. I've kind of just been running running around playing. <laughs> yeah, there's another battling trainers. There's a massive Geodude. I found a rare candy, you. What? what? Dang. All right, One, this guy. two, three. Oh, my first Team Rocket yeah. battle. Yeah. Oh, you found a grunt or what? Yep. You must be quite a ways through the cave then, huh? No, I went down the ladder. Oh, gotcha.
I feel like there's so much more to explore in this cave. Like, I feel like I used to just fly right through Mount Moon. Yeah. What are we at on time? Oh, yeah, you're right. Ah, oh, we're at 20. 20 minutes. Got a great throw on that little Paris. One. Two. Hey, there we go. Let's get it, Beedrill. Oh, I got an evolution. Let's get it, William. William. Oh, that looks so beautiful. So pretty. Best grew to level 10. Sweetness. Oh. Butterfree learned Gust. No confusion yet, though. I got Gust. See, which is really weird because you're supposed to have oh, confusion. Learn confusion at level 10. That's what I thought. An Aether. Dude, that could come in handy later. Yes, sir. Uh, let's see. I'm going to do some transferring real quick. I'm going to go run back and heal. Goodbye, Zubat in Paris. We were staying in Paris. Get away from the Paris. That makes sense why we couldn't catch that Meowth because it was... Not ours. Team Rockets. I didn't even think that it would be Team Rockets. I just thought... Yeah, oh, okay, I, just... I honestly didn't think of that either. <laughs> the Pokeballs changed too when you put them on the conveyor belt. Oh, yeah? My Great Ball was on there. Oh, true, true. You caught a Pokemon with a Great Ball, I'm assuming, right? Yeah. Caught a Gia, dude. She has a Clefairy. Guess that means Cheeks gets the double kick, boy. That Super Nerd didn't have a Magnemite? No, Super Nerd had a, had a Grimer. It might be different for you, though. That is one thick Clefairy, my goodness. Can you catch it? No, it's the trainer's Clefairy. Ooh, that super nerd space, man. I know, isn't it creepy? Very. Why does he have a tablet? He's a super nerd. <laughs> Opposing Clefairy, Clefantum. Dude, rock throw? I already have rock throw? That's cool. What level's your Gia, dude? Level 10. Oh, shoot. Mine's definitely not that high. I mean, I guess it makes sense to give you more to explore when you can just... You don't have, you don't get constantly stopped by wild Pokemon. You can just kind of run around. There we go. Rocket grunt time, boy. Ooh, he's got a he's got a sly look to his face there. Ratatata, tata. Level nine. Not bad leveling down here. Whew. Yeah. Double kick for the win. I like Pikachu's animation for double kick. He just Hops in place. Nice. Little Robbie. Dude, Robbie has Rare a Mankey. Candy. Alright, Beth, this is not a good matchup for you. Yeah, it's so weird you only have to use one controller to play this game, though. I'm still not quite used to that. It's like, I feel like I need to be doing something else with my hands, but I'm like, no, oh, nothing really to do. Score your phone, play some Duel Links, you know. <laughs> right? 
Play Pokemon Go while I'm doing this. Oh, did you run into James down here? Oh, uh, not yet. I, I'm battling this little kid. Yikes, quit following us. Okay, I'm gonna go down this ladder. Because why not? Why not? He's not in this game. <laughs> Wormtail. I found a nugget. Whoa. Ooh. That's like 40, what is that, $5,000? Something like that. Or 50, is it 4,900? I can't remember. Oh yeah, it's gotta be somewhere around there. They might have changed all that too, who knows. Mm. I have no Pokemon that walks around with me right now. I don't know what's going on. What are you doing? I got my Rotata out running around here. Oh, it's because it was a uh, uh, Metapod, but Metapod left my party. Oh, I gotcha. You had a Metapod following you? Yeah, now I have a Beedrill. Okay, we got a Sandshrew out here, and I've got nothing to attack it with. Is that a... Oh, dude, Sandshrew is so cool. I would love a Sandshrew. Actually, though, what am I going to hit the Sandshrew with? If it's got magnet, water. If it's got magnitude, I'm SOL, dude. It might, actually. Poison Sting. Don't poison me first turn. Okay. Um, I don't know what to do to this thing, dude. A fairy is a fairy type, right? Oh, dang. Gusted a lot. <laughs> I just gusted it with William and it almost one-shot him. Let's do it. William's pulling up, man. <laughs> Venus level 14. Yeah, that magic carp is going to be dead weight on my team for quite some time. But when he evolves. But then he evolves. When he evolves, he's going to be carrying, man. The whole team right on his back. Whoa, this camper looks happy. He's a happy camper. Got himself a Geo dude. A nugget. What to do to a Geo dude? Guess I stay in and double kick. Solid. Or you don't say you did. He can't even do anything to me. He just he just sand attacked me because he's scared. All right, Josh, I see you with your sand troop. Oh, yeah, you're right behind me there. I need a water type. Right, I know. Oh, I have, you have a grass, have a grass type. type. Yeah, I was like, what are you doing? I lost my grass type. <laughs> what if it had been a grass type battle? Yeah, it had been nuts. I think mine would have won. Yeah, you had acid. Yeah. I didn't see what he was going into. I'm just going to stay in. Oh, it's just another you, dude. Fine by me. Oh my gosh, there's a trainer with more than one Pokemon? This is That's weird. I know, right? Boy, giving double kick to Pikachu really makes him way more viable for this sort of situation. Let's go, Bellsprout. Beth gaining some levels. Hey, there we go. Now we're learning Rock Throw with our Geodude. Oh. A thousand, a thousand Zubats just swarmed me. <laughs> Sounds about right. Rock Throw, my boy. He has, he has Rock types, doesn't he? What, the camper? Yeah. Oh, there's a Clefairy. Heck yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, he's got two Geodudes. Geodudes don't have sturdy. <laughs> There's no abilities. But there could have been. There could have been. But see, Gen 1 didn't have abilities, so... Gen 1 also didn't have fairies. Exactly. Hey, Clefairy, I want to capture you. I can't get him to... Oh, you punk! 
Hey, that's not a nice word. Oh my gosh, what a pain, dude. Stay. Yes! Ha 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 ha! I caught the Clefairy. Got him. Yeah, got him. Alrighty. Found a pearl. Mother of pearl! <laughs> Mother of pearl! Fire on the poop deck! Fire on the poop deck! Says, I see you have plenty of Pokeballs. If you ever run low, come and talk to me. What does that mean? Uh, There's a guy in here that just gives you Pokeballs? I don't know. That's what he just said. Dang. That's crazy, yo. Is this guy up here? Yeah. Oh, I just ran into Meowth. Mother of Pearl. Fire on the boot deck. Hmm. Hmm. I've got the dome fossil. Girl, I know you like that. It's the meow. Okay, it is. We are at 31 right now, but we are so close to the end of this cave. Uh, no, we're not. We gotta battle the nerd for the fossils. And then Team Rocket. So, are you trying to say you wanna save that for the <laughs> next episode? I think we should. <laughs> yeah, alright. Well, I'll, I'll stay right here, right in front of this grunt right here. Alright, I'm gonna save my game. <laughs> <coughs> oh no! Zubat just flew right at me. This is your episode, isn't it? Uh, this was episode five, so it's yours. <gasps> There's a freaking Chansey right here, dude. Oh my gosh, really? Look at my screen. <gasps> That's insane. Yo, I can't keep it, but I'm gonna catch it. For sure, for sure. Hmm. Yes, I caught it. You caught a chancy, dude. I did, dude. That's insane. That's a lot of experience. 700 experience, what? bro. Dude, everybody leveled up three times. Oh my gosh. That's insane. Dude, Beth ah. is learning stealth rock. I'm upset right now. Dude. I, dude. McCloud is so strong, I, I'm, I think I'm gonna have to take her off the team. <laughs> What's McCloud's level? 16. Oh, people are still growing levels. Oh my goodness. Venus grew to level 16 too. My team is not nearly that strong, Mike. I've got a level 14, 10, 11, 8, 7, 10. Two of Pokemon on my team are, aren't even level 10 yet. Well, Misty does have a level 21, so... I know. Alright, are we, uh... Are you at a spot to call it? I am now. I'm gonna save it again. True. I'm gonna get... I caught, I caught a large Chansey. I'm gonna get rid of these two. Is it my episode? It is my episode. Yeah, episode 5. Alright, you guys. If you guys enjoyed this episode of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee go lock challenge please leave a like comment down below let us know and with that i've been the phantom michael i'm gonna get the heck out of here guys we will see you in the next one bye